Okay, so I ask a question, you ask a question. That's really hard. Okay, me first. What is your best Hong Kong hike? When I come back to Hong Kong, there was a place that we do like river hiking to so you get yeah. your, all yourself wet. Yeah. That's it. What's one ingredient you cannot bring yourself to eat? Uh, or you cannot eat that? I cannot eat it. You cannot eat it. Nothing. <laughs> Nothing. Nothing. Although crazy, one time I was in uh, Guangzhou and there was a crazy dish where they literally took the bacteria of the the lake water on the top and they steamed it. And and we ate that first thing for breakfast after I was hungover. Not a pleasant experience. So never in China say you eat everything. Okay, sure. Yeah. Uh, something you'll always find in your fridge. Spring onion. Kitchen utensil you cannot live without. I like an offset spatula. Your favorite comfort food? Soup. If you were a cocktail, what would you be? Dirty martini. <laughs> okay. Savory. Actually, no, I'm easy going, so I like to drink that. So, no, I am not a dirty martini. No. I'd be like. Doot, doot. I'll just be an old fashioned. <laughs> uh, what's the first thing you ate this morning? Coffee. <laughs> <laughs> Chef's just coffee. coffee, just coffee. An unpopular opinion about food that you have. Unpopular. I didn't write these questions. You have one skip. <laughs> skip, well, this one's too hard. This is just, you know, quick fire, isn't it? Not quick fire. Cardio or strength training? Strength, Shr absolutely. Oh, power move, okay. Um, a song you can't stop listening to. Oh, I love the uh, new, um, what's that, Encanto? Cannot even. Surface pressure. Sing it. Next time. Next time. <laughs> Surface pressure. So good. What's the one book or movie every chef should read or watch? Wow. 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 That's so hot. Uh, uh, Howard McGee's uh, food about food. Oh, what's science. the title? Food science, yes. What's your ultimate hangover cure? Oh, this is embarrassing. The, the I eat McDonald's. Yeah, okay. very disgraceful. I try to like not be seen if I if if you see me at McDonald's, I'm very hungover. Favorite Hong Kong breakfast? Uh, congee. Congee. Yeah. Your favorite awesome. uh, snack? Yeah. I'm like a savory person. It sounds crazy. Chicken soft bone. Chicken what? Like salt and pepper chicken uh, soft okay. bone. Like people eat popcorn, I'll be like, yo, let's order some soft bone. <laughs> Very Hong Kong that way. Which actor should play you in a film about your life? Skip. <laughs> <laughs> your favorite way to cook an egg? A soft boiled. Okay. What's your favorite rice dish? Usually I I think I'm quite traditional. I like my rice plain, Steam rice, yeah. and then just have different things to go with it. No matter yeah. the soup or yeah. stew if or the braise. Rice is really good. It should be plain. Yeah, yeah, that's true. An eating habit that other people might find strange. Eating habit that people would find strange. Mm. I think all our heat. I think all sh all eating habits are strange. <laughs> we don't eat breakfast. We eat at five, <laughs> and then. Um, my partner thinks I'm starving myself all the time, and uh, uh, when I eat a lot of like innards and, and and different like breakfast and dinner for me is like like I only eat, like to eat the same thing whether it's breakfast or dinner. Do you love or hate coriander? Love. Love. What's the last restaurant you ate at? I ate at um, Astro. I actually recently tried Astro. What's one ingredient you would never give up? You, you have to cook with. You cannot ever not cook with. Probably spring onion. That's why it's always in my fridge. Mm. Um, your favorite Hong Kong phrase? I, I love when the... I don't know when did it start or why did it start, but my chef always say like, Gong Li Di, which is... Uh, uh, what does that, where does that come from? Why did they say Gong Li Di? Um, I mean, it is something that we normally say, but it also was, I think, popular in the Kanto, uh, uh, not a movie, what is that called? It was on a show, and then 
there's this girl keep saying, oh, gong li di. Yeah. So, I like, so my kitchen, like, every time I tell them, wow, gong li di. Cool. What would you be if you weren't a chef? Psychologist. Nice. Uh, where would you go for your first food holiday? After COVID. Yeah. Going to Mexico. Cool. Nice.